Good morning to the honorable judges, fellow timekeepers, my fellow friends, and everyone. Thank you for inviting me to give a talk here today. I would like to give a talk on the topic, the importance of art in our everyday life. That includes some of my own opinions. My dear audience, every morning, many people enjoy watching the sunrise. They feel relaxed seeing the arrival of the sun with its pure light and the passing of the darkness of the night. They consider that the new light starts as the sun starts rising. Not only do they enjoy watching the sunrise, but many people enjoy putting this view on the canvas because they feel relaxed doing so. This highlights the importance of art in our daily life. Art is your emotions flowing in the river of imagination. Art is everywhere and everything in life is an artwork. If we stand for a moment in front of any piece of art which has many shapes and lines, you begin to imagine things by walking on the shapes and lines and trying to connect them to get a specific shape done from your imagination. No one these days truly knows the importance of art. It's one's creativity and imagination. Art is everywhere in the entire world. Now, I would like to explain two types of arts. One, audio arts, and two, visual arts. Audio arts are the most used type of art. It helps in relaxing one's smile and mood in every way. It's a successful and self-motivated person listen to special songs and music. You will never find a successful person who doesn't listen to motivating songs. Next, visual arts. Visual arts are also called popular arts. They differ from audio arts because artists places images, forms, colors, and their ideas in such a way that can be communicated with you, the viewers. Let's say for example, an artist will take you on a trip around his or her journey and he will try to tell you what to view and in what order. He will attempt to provoke a variety of feelings, even negative ones. He will invoke in you your sense of wonder. So this is the importance of art. Because to conclude my talk, I would like to say that art is universal and it is everywhere. Art can affect one's mood and it can make the whole world colorless, depressive and boring. So if one doesn't really know what the real meaning of art is, he or she have to look at everything surrounding him or her and everything they use in their daily life. Like for example, the hairstyle, the clothes and the shoes, all of them are arts. So without art, one cannot see anything beautiful because art adds attraction and beauty to everything one can look at, even he or she looks at himself. So that's all for today. Thank you for my talk. Thank you.